So let's say I wanted to find the mass of this part when it's a certain material. I'm using FreeCAD link branch, so some things might look a little different than the standard FreeCAD. So I need to make a macro that will find the volume and then do the calculation to find the mass with a given material. So click on macros, macros. We need to create a new macro. The name is not really relevant. I'll say mass properties, but you can name it literally whatever you want. Go to this link that's in the description. I'm going to control A, control C to select all and copy all of that. Go back over to FreeCAD, control V, and then I will save that with control S. This is now saved. I can close out of there. And what this does is it just creates a new macro and it saves it in the default location. You don't need to worry about where that is. So I can close that tab now. And if I go back to my macros here, there it is. There it is under user macros. I can hit execute and we get this menu on the right that has all sorts of information. But really what I'm concerned about right now is down here, the area and volume. So I can click on this body and I can click on unit, say I want that to be grams, say I want the material to be ABS, and now I have my mass right there, and you can add new materials if you want, um, you know, say printing something out of PTG, whatever the density is, whatever the cost is, and then some other information. And I can hit enter, and there, I get another mass property over there. So that's another option that's helpful with this. Now, say I want to access this a little easier because obviously it takes up a lot of space. I don't always want that there. You can go back into macros, click on this, and click toolbar. You can OK this. It's just a guided walkthrough. So fill in the missing fields, optional, click add, then close. I recommend doing this pix map right here. You can just set any sort of icon that you want. And I can add that. You can put a keyboard shortcut if you want. I'll click add and then close and it opens this so I already have a custom one here but I will delete this to show what you need to do so it will default to the global workbench right here when I click new it doesn't matter what you name it we'll just say custom and then you need to click on the macro over here that you just made and then use the right arrow button and it puts it in that custom toolbar now and we can close that we can close that and now we see here we have our mass properties so I can unlock these and I can move this to a more convenient location just out of the way by itself and now I can click on that at any time to show or hide that menu. And again, I can just click on that body. It tells me there's the body, it's solid. But again, I just want to see the volume or more than likely I want to see the mass in whichever unit here. So hope that helps.